Hi everybody and welcome back to the medium town of Revilia, where things are going good and bad. We only have two months of food, which is bad. It's spring, which is good. And uh, yeah, we do, we have some problems with food. I took a few measures. I love the way these buildings look. Look at this. This is looking so good. Ah, oh, man. I already took some measures to ensure that our people don't starve to death. Yeah, two months of food. Real bad. So, in our trading... Oh, man, I'm about to lose my voice. I set all of these to be imported for now. Just till we get back on our feet. And we're only going to import a little bit. Just to help us out for now. Wow, look at our graveyard. It's getting big. Okay, so we also have our point to spend. Let's do that now. And there are tons of things that I would love to do. I would love to get this deep mine thing so we have eternal mines. But I think this is a necessity. Look at this. Forest management doubles capacity of all berry deposits. We run out of berries so fast. I would love to make some candles and such. And we could do doubling the amount of meat. That would really be nice as well. But I think this would be the most helpful. Let's get those berries in. I don't want our people to starve. Good. We did that. That's real nice. It's time for part two of my plan of not starving to death and that's to build more farms. We have this one farmhouse. Look at all these farms that he's dealing with. We have them in kind of groups of three because you have the, the first year, second year, third year. So we have uh, each year one of the three fields in a group will be wheat and then two will be fallow and they'll kind of rotate. So we have those four, these four, and this one for nine total fields. I want to build three more. Ah, and I think I know where I want to build them. I want to build them down here. Let's take a look at our, is it Emmer? So yeah, we should be able to fit three more right here. We're gonna have to get rid of this road. Get out of here. All right, good, it only took up to there. Nice. Yeah, rye is something that we unlock later which would be fantastic but for right now we got to do emmer so this field really not in the best spot but it'll do it'll be fine let's get ourselves some more fields we're gonna put it right up against this guy right to the edge we're looking for one whole morgan can we we got 1.1 morgan that'll do give me 1.1 morgan <laughs> nice all right, let's put another one. Hopefully get one full Morgan. Morgans are the best, aren't they? Oh, that's a 1.2. That's a little too much Morgan for me. I'd like a little less. 1.1 again. Perfect. All right. And then we'll finish this out by... We'll start here. Come down. Will this be a 1.1? It is. Happy day. All right, nice. So we got the additional three. We'll build some roads in a second. So this one, we will make wheat this first year, right? And we're going to do crop rotation. The next two years will be fallow. Fantastic. And then this one, we're going to have fallow the first year. And then the second year will be wheat, and then it'll be fallow again. Good. And then this one will be fallow, fallow, and then wheat. Perfect. Ha, ah, nice. All right, let's go ahead and unpause it, and let's get a road around this entire thing. Let's start, ooh, thank you. Let's start up here. Oh, look at that. Attach to that little node is there another one over here somewhere there is nice we'll attach to that come around just go to there and then this guy 
continue this down, connect up to this. There we go. Perfect. Nice. We got our additional fields in. And since we have so many people just on a sign doing some building, let's get them to work building ourselves another farmhouse. I think this will be very, very beneficial. And look, we could put it right on this corner too. It's perfect. Should we put it on this corner? Even better. Farmhouse location. I feel yeah. Definitely. Nice. Getting another farmhouse in. And also, we're gonna need we're gonna need a few things. I would like to have not a sheep farm. We're gonna have another windmill, yes. I was actually what am I even looking for? Oh yeah, storage, logistics, right? Yeah, I want another granary. Or granary, however you want to pronounce that. Where are we gonna put the windmills? I want to make sure we have them in a good location. Maybe just up in here. Or back here. That would probably look cool. Alright, so, granary. And we'll restrict this granary so that it'll only have, you know, wheat and grain and all that good stuff. We could just put it right across the street. Looking kind of nice. Maybe right here? Or... Yeah, I'm thinking across the street. Perfect. We'll get it right there. Nice. What else did we need? These windmills. It can just be up here. That would probably look nice, right? We'll start with just one. Yeah, we'll put them down the road just a little bit. Nice. Efficiency is up. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Good stuff. All right. We got all of that in place. Hopefully they'll start working on that. What's up with you? Generic storage is full. I hate to hear it. How are we doing on animals? I believe we were ordering horses. Yeah, we we can order another one. That's real good. Did we get, we have two horses for this, right? Well, I think one is an ox that's actually here. Yeah, we got Phil. <laughs> Oh, that's great. Phil and Penelope working for this place. Yeah, there we go. So we'll get two horses over here. Nice. And then we really need to order some more oxen in. Ooh, we should also get a well for down here. This new little farming area. Oh, good. We have this that runs right through. We could do something like this. Put it here. Ooh, that's not a bad idea. We put it here and then connect a little road on each side. There we go. Yeah, you can't really put a little curve on it. That's what I was hoping I could do. Yeah, it's something like that. It's interesting. I also wanted to get another stable down here by these farms as well. That is not it. I could never find anything in this menu. I don't even bother. There we go. Hitching post. I guess we could put it next to the granary. Right across the way there. Or, ooh, I like that. That looks nice. Cool. Off this little side road. We'll upgrade that as soon as they build it. And I would also like, I just want to build everything in this nice little area down here. We need some houses, right? Hopefully we'll get some farmers to move in down here by the fields. That would be cool. Ooh, somebody wants to live down here, don't they? Look at this, right on this little corner, right next to the field. That'd be cool. And we could have it facing the field, maybe. That would probably look cool. Let's see what that's like. Actually, let's start from up here so that we can hug this road. I think I want to make it even bigger. Gonna make it a big home. There we go. We'll just make it one. Nice. Just a one big home right there. That's gonna look fantastic. And I don't want anything too close to this windmill. 
So I'm guessing the, just right here, maybe we could have a home or two across the street, and that's pretty much it. Maybe we'll just have one right next to this. And do the same thing. We'll just make it a single one. Nice. That should all look pretty good when it comes up. And then we're going to have so many more farmers that we could have running around dealing with all of this. Oh yeah, I also, I just remembered, I realized what this is, the annual royal tax. That's how much we owe, is the 254 right there. I mean, obviously, duh. I don't know why I looked at that and I got so confused. I thought that's like how much money we had for taxes or something. I don't know what the hell I was thinking, but that's how much we owe. That's how much we have. That's our approval rating. Is it time to tax people again? It is, isn't it? What? Just the mere mention of it. <laughs> I just mentioned taxes and they're like, no. So what is it, you? You're off? Why are you? Yeah, we're, we don't have any food, okay? Everybody's starving to death. <laughs> Deal with it. Jeez, I'm trying to tax you. Give me a break. There we go. Damn, taxes. I don't feel bad because of that person. <laughs> All right. I, I mean, we have enough to cover it, but we don't have extra money for a rainy day, you know, where we might want to, you know, pay mercenaries to kill people type rainy day. We need money for that sort of thing, so we're going to start taxing them again. Our approval is fantastic. Public order. Drinking never negative one. That's cool. I mean, it's not cool, but... That's cool that that's in the game. And it's because we have beer now. Because we did a good job. That helped out so much. Upping that. Ah, it's good stuff. Alright, they're still building all of this down here. And I didn't build a communal oven for this little farmhouse area. And that's because what I want to do is upgrade one of these guys, right? Like, we have chicken coop right now, but look at this, the bakery extension. Oh, it's so good. It's twice the efficiency of a communal oven. And I can't wait to see what it looks like. So we're going to maybe not do that. And oh my goodness, I just had a thought. This giant house on the side. Can that be a giant bakery? That might be cool. I was, mm, I kind of want to, we could have two, actually, now that I'm thinking about it. I want to have one in the center of town, right? Like near the market. Oh my god, check this out. Hold on. So you're walking around the market, you know, excuse me, sir. And you just, you smell in the air just delicious bread being breaked and being baked. <laughs> not breaked. We're not breaking the bread. Bread. Oh my god, I can't English. <sighs> Just, I, I completely screwed I was trying to like immerse you into this wonderful idea of smelling bread in the village, but I can't speak English so I ruined it, so I'm just gonna walk away. I'm done. I'm done with this conversation. We have work to do anyway. What the hell now? Royal tax increased. I love how these are just blank screens. Is that supposed to be something that I just can't see? Is it just me or is this... I know this is still in development, so I'm not, you know, it's cool, but I'm just curious if that's, uh, on me or not. But yeah, apparently that was increased. Ugh, we still have 215 days, and we have well more than enough, so it's fine. We should be totally fine. Good. Back to construction. I love sitting here and watching them build. It's so fun. It looks so nice. They're building the granary now. Good. It looks like the farmhouse was done. Man, these people are very efficient. Good job, everyone. Good job all around. Alright, how does this work again? Do we have to... Threshing priorities medium. Okay. 
connected to a road network. That's nice. I don't think we have to mess with anything, really. I'm gonna stick a family here straight away. Let's just see what they do. <laughs> right? What are you guys up to? Plowing by hand. Uh-oh. Pause. It's May. Plowing by hand is now occurring. It's time to fill up. <laughs> fill up on farmers. Let's do this. All right. How many extra people are we going to have left to build? <laughs> Not many. All right. We got all of these guys going in. Nice. And we now have this as well. We need at least one builder. We need to pull some people from some jobs. I know we stuck some, yeah, we stuck some people here. That's good. Uh, where's our furnace? That's a stable. <laughs> I always click the wrong building down here. We got two here. We'll take one from there. That'll be good. Nobody should be here. Good. Very, very good. I don't think there's anywhere else that we could pull from. So let's go ahead and unpause it and see about sticking. Maybe we'll do half full this year and we'll see how it goes. Nice. All right. So all of these people getting to work. Oh, please get to work, guys. We need bread so bad. Awesome. All right. They're doing their thing. Oh, this is so cool. I am loving this game. I'm glad a lot of you guys seem to be enjoying the series so far. I'm hoping it's going to be a long one. Wow, we just spent 500 bucks. That was everything. <laughs> Did we get food in, though, at least? That would be nice. What would you guys get? Where'd everything go? <laughs> I thought we would have tons of stuff in storage. Is it here? Yeah, we got a bunch of crap down here. Hmm. I'm hoping we bought food. Yeah, we have 10 meat, 10 berries. Okay. I think we did. We we got some food in. I think we'll be okay now. Oh, and we got the doubled thing. Huh. We should consider getting another forager hut. Let's do that. Let's build another one. Maybe we could tuck this one in across the street from this little house. Yeah, that would be cool. Or maybe in this little clearing right here. Um, what is it? This one? Yeah. Since we doubled our capacity, double our foragers. We need more people to move in. <laughs> Jeez, we can't staff all of this. Alright, since we got some food in, Let's stop importing it. I think we'll be okay now. Right? No more thank you. It's just from now on, we're not going to trade food anymore. We're going to keep that for ourselves. Always. I thought we were cool selling tons of bread. Turns out, no. It's not cool to sell bread. That's what losers do. I actually am going to still import bread. I just realized it's going to be a while before we get some grain and we make some bread. So everything else we could turn off. We should be good. But bread, please continue. Get us some bread. Oh my goodness. We need food. That's pretty cool that you could see both of our farmhouses. They're all working together. Pretty much. There's some random people just like frolicking about in fields and stuff, which is nice, but everybody's coming together to slowly plow by hand this entire field. Nice. Hopefully it'll actually do some growing this year. That would be nice. Ah, we really need that bread so bad. Things are coming along down here, though. This is almost done. The well was done. We have the granary, it's going to be very important. The houses, not so important. I'm actually, I'm going to turn the priority low on these. I really do want to see what they look like, but... You know, some things are more important than aesthetics. Not much. Oh, good. We, we need more people to move in, but at the same time, that's more mouths to feed. <laughs> oh, jeez. All right, perfect. We got the forager's hut nice and built. Oh, yeah, we could do the herb. Do we have the money for this? We do, 
but we barely have enough money. And I do... Hold on, I'm going to pause it real quick. I want to order another oxen. Or was it another horse? I think we were going to get another horse to help with trading, right? Right. Yeah. Order a new horse. Because how many... What is here? Oh, there is two. There's a horse and a horse. We have the two horses. Oh, that's fantastic. You're not Jacob. You're Steve. Okay, I keep hitting that and it brings up my military. It's good that we check this every now and then though, right? How are we doing? Fantastic, actually. Look at our military. We're almost maxed out. Good. Okay, back to what I was trying to do. The more important thing, name my livestock. <laughs> it's not Jacob, it's Steve. We talked about this. Jeez. Okay. This is... I think... <laughs> I think I might have a problem with this. Jacob just does not want to be named Jacob. Maybe if we zoom in and just be really quiet, right? No, as soon as you hit V, it brings that up. You can't be named Steve. <laughs> ha! How do you like that shit? <laughs> got it in the end. So we got Steven. And we're gonna have Sammy. Sammy and Steven. Nice. They're both waiting, which is real good. But we're gonna put both of you to work straight away across the street here. No, I. Hold on. I always forget. Oh no, is it the advanced one? Yes. That should be good. So now if we go into here, Penelope. <laughs> Penelope and Ott. Okay. That's fine. What happened? <laughs> uh, whatever. Alright, so we got those two there. Who's here then? I thought Penelope... Okay. How many horses named Penelope do we have? <laughs> I think we may have made some mistakes. You can't be Penelope. That's just unrealistic. Your name is now Sarah. Hi, Sarah. It's a good name for a horse, right? Just Sarah. And you're a horse too, right? You are. I, don't, I have no idea what to name you, Jared. There you go, Jared. Jared and Sarah. That does not really roll off the tongue very well. But, more importantly, this was done. Let's get two people over here straight away. And hopefully that'll be enough. That'll leave us with one builder. And that should be more than enough to take care of this. Cool. Cool beans. All right, and I did, we had another family move in and I had them, where am I right now? I had them work here. There you go. And they finished this. It should be growing now. It is, it is indeed growing. Oh, fantastic. Things will be fine. Food is still a little sketch, but I'm I'm positive things will be A-OK. -okay. Did we finish the... No. Oh, this. Hitching post, please. Get this done next. Very high. The one family. Get on that. It's very important. We can order another one straight away, though, right? Not a horse. I want to get more oxen. Yeah. Good. I wanted to make sure I had enough for that. And we should save the rest to get in some more bread. Right? Because I put bread orders back on the plate so that our people don't starve. Because I care. Right? Deep down, I'm a caring, charismatic leader. Look at all these wonderful people just marching on by. <laughs> this is great. Let's go join them. It's conga line time. Where'd they go? Hey. What's going on, guys? Alright, come on, Toots. I am a slow walker. Man, you guys are putting me to shame. I see we just spent some money there at the trading post. Hopefully that was bread. Are you guys hungry? Hmm? You guys real hungry? It's fine, though. I care about you. Alright, it looks as though all of our farmers are now playing the waiting game. They did all of their plowing by hand. Some of them are still doing some menial things, transporting some stuff. But 
Let's take them all back. We're gonna leave another skeleton crew here, just for no reason whatsoever. Probably shouldn't do that. I mean, someone has to guard the place, right? We're gonna max this out. I guess we may as well... Let's do it. We're gonna do it now, because I'll forget about it, and we'll never get it done. So good. We did that. Fantastic. Tons of people here. Doing nothing? That's right. Doing nothing. Can't have that. Look at this workforce that we have now. Holy crap. Oh, I wish we had things to build. We don't really have much to build right now. We're gonna put them to work doing other things. Like, uh... Oh yeah. Our wonderful potting and potting industry. It's a tiling industry, actually. We make roof tiles. But, you know, we need more. So, let's bring this up to full production since we have the people. And we still have four people that we can use for building. Which is nice. Is there anything else we want to ramp up? I don't really think so. We really... What the hell is this? Not enough stable space. Oh, I ordered the... Okay. Well, we do have a whole bunch of builders now. And I did make this... The highest priority just now. So... Please get that built real fast. I don't know if our oxen just has to wait patiently out of view. I hope he's waiting patiently. He better be a patient oxen. Awesome. As soon as they finish that, that little warning went away. Good. All right, let's upgrade this straight away. And then hopefully by then, yeah, we have the money now to get another oxen. But you have to wait for the little cool down period anyway. Good. We need some kind of like, like what we were doing here, how we had like Oxen Alley down here. I need more of this. We needed a bigger Oxen, Oxen, oh god. We need another alley where we could put livestock, that's what I'm trying to say. And we have the builders, so let's do that real quick. Okay, got an idea. Originally, I saw this road along here, and I figured we could just use that. But that just seems kind of cruel, putting them so close to this stinky burning stuff. So, we could just, we have this nice little intersection right here, and we have a stable right there. And none of this space is really going to be used for anything. We want to expand the houses over on this side. But running a road straight out this way and having a whole bunch of stables? That sounds perfect. That sounds just about perfect how's that looking that should be enough space to start we'll bring it out a little further there we go all right let's make a whole bunch of stables for hitching posts where are they at i'll find them don't worry we might want to put another pasture too can you use pastures to just store animals huh i'm not sure I think you can. It makes sense. Alright, I want to pack them in as much as we can. So, put one here. And we can connect them that close, right? Maybe just those to start. That'll probably be good to get us underway. Because we still have to order all the oxen. That's going to take forever. Alright, well, that's where I'm going to have to go ahead and end things today. We got a whole lot done. We have a whole new farming area, which is going to be fantastic. Oh, really looking forward to getting that going. Getting food in so our people don't starve to death. I think we're going to be okay. As long as we go by the newfound rule. Wow, we just went right over that. That was fun. As long as we go by the rule of no longer selling any of our food and just keeping it for ourselves we should be fine we should be a-okay i think we just went a little too crazy selling some bread and we learned our lesson so moving forward we should be able to continue upgrading this beautiful town to a large town and i'd like to upgrade one of these houses to get 
our first artisan bakery. Ah, oh, it's gonna be great. So, I'd like to thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed watching, please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel for more amazing videos, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye! Fresh meat here. No finer cuts in all the